Cybercrime is, is affecting the world today in, on a scale that's, that's unimaginable. I know Trevor you know, put out some figures there, and in, in many cases, those figures are the total budgets or the total value of many, many organizations. They're even the total value of, of countries, of budgetary countries. Now, the swiftness with which cyber, cyber crime is escalating is, is mind-boggling. We see where just in, in the last two years alone, the amount of unique malware samples has more than doubled to in the region of 500 million. Now, cyber, the motives behind, behind, um, the, motives behind the attacks, 71% of those motives is cyber crime. So the, the individuals or the malicious individuals, their, their sole intent is to extract money from the data that they're, they're taking from you. Three years ago, just three years ago, the Wall Street Journal estimated that cybercrime would cost the US $100 billion. Two years following that, Lloyds of London has revised that figure, and it's costed upwards of $400 billion, and the projection for 2019 is upwards of $2.1 $2 trillion. Now, I think the figures themselves are, 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 are staggering, and people oftentimes have have a little bit of difficulty wrapping their minds around the magnitude of these figures. But the figures are real. Uh, Cybercrime is a very, very big business. It's very lucrative because of the anonymity of, of the internet. You commit the crime, you get away, and prosecution, as been mentioned before, is, is very, 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 very limited. Yeah.